Uh, hi, in this uh, tutorial, you will learn about uh, Flogorithm if statement. If statement in Flogorithm is a diamond shape uh, symbol. So, to add, uh, right click on the control line and under the control section, you will find the if uh, diamond symbol. Click on it to add to the flowchart. Uh, we will use the if statement in uh, Flogorithm to make decisions based on the condition in the if uh, symbol um, there are two uh, branches that the if statement can execute the one is the true branch and the other one is the false branch so if the condition that you have given in the if statement evaluates to true, true then the true uh, branch will be executed and if the condition is false the false uh, branch will be executed uh, let's understand the concept with an help of an example so uh, let's uh, in this example we'll prompt the user to enter a number and in the flowchart we'll decide uh, if the number is positive negative or zero so let's uh, declare a variable called x prompt the user to enter a number this take the input from the user into the variable x so in the input uh, symbol uh, specify the variable x now uh, add a uh, if uh, statement right click and choose the diamond if statement so in the if statement we can specify the condition in the diamond box so double click on the diamond box and specify the condition as x greater than 0 so if x is greater than 0 if it is true then x is a positive number so in the true branch of saying that x is positive number so if x is not greater than 0 then add another if statement so this is a nested if under another if so here if x is less than 0 so if x is less than 0 then true then uh, x is a negative number if not x is uh, not greater than 0 and if it is not x less than 0 then x should be 0 specify x is 0 note that 0 is either not uh, positive or negative number okay save the flowchart and run click on the green play button so here uh, enter number let's say 34.5 you can see that the output x is a positive number because 34.5 is a positive number we'll run some another test case uh, let's say uh, minus 5 then we'll see the output of the flowchart here you can see that x is negative number minus 5 is a negative number Okay, we will run another test case let's say and we will specify 0 see x is 0 so uh, 0 is either not uh, positive or a negative number okay hope you under, uh, understood the if statement so here we have in this flowchart we have uh, used two if statements one and inside another uh, if statement there is a nested if statement okay thank you